How do you and the, the other members of the Who feel about it? Are you sick to death of it now? Um, not really, because, you see, every time we play it, um, it sounds different. You know, this, is the, this is one of the great things about um, rock and roll music, is that, that it's never the same. I mean, you never play the same riff twice. You, know, you never play the same drum pattern twice. So that all the time you're, you're thinking up new things to play, new dynamics, um, just ways to improve on the original. Um, so it, it's, got, it's got boring insofar as it does appear to be the only topic of conversation that we've had for the past three years. Um, so I'm fed up with talking about it. I'm certainly not fed up with playing it. There was a, a report in the rock press not so long ago uh, about the fact that Pete Townsend was supposed to be working on an opera that was based on The Who rather than one individual person outside the band. What's become of that? Uh, still in the throes of writing. Um, not being a, a writer, um, a songwriter. Um, I mean, every songwriter has his or her own way of writing and you must be in a certain mood to write I mean maybe Pete won't write anything for a week and then all of a sudden go in and knock off half a side of the album um, but I I know that it's very well underway and I've spoken to Pete uh, regarding this and he's knocked out Say, well, his actual words to me were that it could very possibly be the best thing that we've ever done. In fact, that anybody in pop has ever done. There's been a, a quite a dramatic change in the Who's music since Tommy. Um, it seems to become a lot more mellow, a lot more sophisticated, uh, and in fact, a lot more intricate. Is it? Uh, would this be a byproduct of, of Pete's religious ideas spreading uh, different sort of vibrations throughout the, the group? No, I think it, um, well, I think that could be part of it. But it certainly isn't the, um, the main reason. There is no one reason you could pin down. Um, the fact is that we've, we all realised that the band had to do something new, something exciting, something different, something that, uh, still retained all the vital ingredients of the Who, but at the same time um, presented to the public a new facet of the Who that they hadn't seen before. And you see, if it, you see, there's no one member in the group that can dictate uh, for the group to work as a group. We've all got to agree when are we likely to see it, uh, a tour by the Who here? A good question, and one that I wish I could answer. Uh, we've got two tours of the States coming up. We've got two albums to finish. We've got a tour, tour of Europe. Um, and that's just next week. 